Hello, this time I will show you how to make the track drive. When I was building the mower, uh, I decided to go with uh, uh, snowblower tracks because they are the cheapest one. Uh, I actually had uh, three options on the table. First was to buy a second-hand track drive, which of course I couldn't find any. The second option was to buy a new track drive from AliExpress for 200 euros with shipping cost of 300 euros and with the VAT and customs uh, cost of 200 euros ending up at 700 euros for complete two track drives and there was a third option just to buy uh, basic parts and uh, make drive by myself. I end up with the last option, building the complete two-track drives for 200 euros. All right, allow me to move the camera and disassemble the track. Let me start from the motor side. On wheelchair motor you can see small gear uh, and on the other side, on the track drive, you can see a bigger gear connected with a bicycle chain. Uh, these motors are rated at 10 km per hour, uh, which I reduced to 3 km, uh, km per hour. Uh, which is also recommended speed for uh, commercial remote control lawn mowers. Uh, actually, they have uh, speed around four to five kilometers, but I find um, three kilometers per hour just right for this uh, lawn mower. Here you can see something that I think is called wheel hub from an old car which I got from a local shop for free, of course, on which I mounted the main wheel. Next, you can see a wheel that spins freely, which is mounted on mechanism that tensions the track. Let me show you from the top uh, with this screw, uh, turning it to clockwise, you tension the track and with this bolt you can fix that everything stay in the position and just to be more clear maybe to remove this part so you can see by yourself okay and uh, this part with the tensioning screw. Okay, nothing special and very easy to build. As you can see the track is back on mower and I would like to mention two things more. First uh, thing is that uh, when I was driving on the higher slopes I noticed that um, this uh, wheel uh, is cutting the edge of the track. So I made uh, this uh, track holder that holds the uh, track in the position on the higher slopes. Uh, the idea is not mine. I saw this solution on Yamaha uh, commercial snowblower. And um, second thing is um, for all of you that would like to know the dimensions of the track, uh length of the track is uh, almost 47 centimeters and the height is about 20 22 uh, centimeters of course i would like that uh, the tracks are a little bit longer but these are the standard tracks from a snowblower and 
uh, all of them are almost the same size. All right, that's all for today. Uh, I hope you found some useful information for your project. Please don't forget to like and subscribe, and see you next week in another video. Bye!